till six. This is Drive with Adam Shands. It's 19 minutes to six, thanks to your company. We're talking about cyber safety and the need for an e-safety commissioner. I've had a call now from Paul Litherland, who's a former policeman who runs a cyber safety website called Surf Online Safe. Good afternoon, Paul. Hi, Adam. How are you? Good. What's your view? Do we need this e-safety commissioner? I mean, I'm, I'm all for legislation and, and anyone who can regulate or, or assist in any parent of a child who's um, being bullied online. But I think parents need to be very guarded in regards to relying or, or allowing to um, their, their guard, I suppose, to go down in regards to this legislation because, it, in my opinion, to a degree, it, it can be sort of a toothless tiger. The reason I say that is a great deal of our social networking organisations are international. So being able to enforce this legislation is actually going to be very difficult. And we look at, say, the two, uh, the top three social networking sites where um, most of our online bullying and, and um, vilification, all that sort of occurs, is Facebook, Instagram and uh, Ask FM. Now, those two top ones uh, are run out of the US and Ask FM has run out of Latvia, so... Latvia? Gee, yeah, so lots of luck so getting them to, to do anything, I guess. And, and that's right. So for, for a WA legislative authority to, to go, right, OK, this is not good enough, um, we want it taken off, it, it's going to be very difficult. And, I, and I'd challenge any one of your listeners to try and find a phone number or an email address for, for Facebook uh, or, or Instagram, for that matter, and it, it's almost impossible. So it, it, it's why I, I, I introduce... Uh, sorry, why I'm, I'm welcome for it to be introduced. Again, it's just a matter of uh, hoping that this is just a, another little bit of piece of information that parents can use to assist themselves in, in dealing with the online habits of their kids. But education, I suppose, is, is the most priority, uh, or main priority that parents should be looking at, and hopefully they can, they can continue to do that over time. Yeah, very good point. Thanks for your call, Paul. Thanks, yeah, I think that's a really good point that, uh, you know, we can't get police to come to our homes uh, on the double when there's a burglary, let alone trying to, to, to get a, a bureaucracy in Canberra to, to get something pulled down from the net which is being posted from Latvia. Hmm, lots of luck. Andrew's